this is a very simple application. And as unusual as it seems at first, we're actually seeing quite a few of you that are needing something like this. So let's take a look at how it works. This is useful if you have a fire alarm control panel or some other older piece of gear that only takes in contact closures. And you're still required to use it, whether it's a regulation or you just don't have an alternative yet. But the world is going to be more protocol based. So you see more and more equipment nowadays where it doesn't have any contact closures at all. It only uses a protocol like SNMP or Modbus or DNP to output alarm data. So how can we bridge the gap? Well, this trap relay device you see in the middle of the diagram here, this is developed to translate SNMP to contact closures. So let's start at the top. SNMP enabled equipment is going to be sending SNMP traps in different versions to the trap relay 32 device. You're going to database in the web interface of this device what the different traps that you're looking for are. So you might specify an OID or a variable binding that the trap relay will use to identify incoming traps. And when it spots one, say it spots trap number six, then it's going to latch contact closure number six and so on. It has 32 different traps and it has 32 relays that it can latch. You'll also database for each trap a corresponding clear trap and that's the one that will tell the relay to release so you're able to latch and release relays in response to inbound SNMP. You'll see that there's also a 64, a trap relay 64 and that's the same device with just double the capacity. You can take in 64 different traps and you can latch and release 64 different relays. Because of all of that output capacity, all those relays are not tiny, we go to a 2RU chassis so it's two rack units high, but it is still fitting into a 19 or a 23 inch rack and you'll get both sets of ears if you order it. And the last thing you'll see here, DC input. This is available in negative 48. We have some devices that are in plus 24 or plus 12. So whatever voltage you need, just let us know. And if you do wanna use AC, we can include a wall transformer so you can still power the device via AC. So if you have any questions, you wanna learn more about this trap relay or any other SNMP equipment from DPS, hop on the website, dpstele.com or call 1-800-693-0351.